Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Uh, today I'm just going to be doing a ramp test just to check the focal point of the laser. Uh, to do that you just need two pieces of material like this. That top board there, you just need to make sure that it's nice and straight. And then uh, bring the laser head over and sort of just get it lined up on the edge. Do it on the edge because it's easier to, uh, to measure sort of after you've done the test. Uh, I'll just show you on the controller here, there's a pulse button and there's a right arrow key. So it's just a matter of holding in the pulse button and pushing that right arrow key to, uh, I guess, engrave the line. Uh, so just pop it back here. So yeah, hold down the pulse button. Oh, hold up. I'll just redo that one again because my finger didn't stay on the pulse button properly. So I'll just move that back a bit and line that back up. And go again. That's better. I'll just take you over and show you there. It's You can see that it starts out thick comes through to be thin in the middle and then it starts out uh, sort of tails out thick as well so uh, obviously the best focal point is the thinnest part of the line so I'll just mark you know, roughly where my thinnest point is somewhere around there and then obviously keeping the laser head in that same spot you just sort of bring that back and put it straight over the top of the mark there and then you just want to measure the distance between the bottom of the laser head and the top of the material um, with the laser that I bought it came with a little acrylic tab on the key uh, which says that the focal length is actually 15 millimeters so I'm just going to pop that under there and just make sure that, that it should touch the bottom of the nozzle and the top of the material which there it does yep that's good um, so that's quite good there so at least uh, at least that means it's spot on uh, you can use uh, a ruler or um, got a set of calipers here that you could use to measure that measure that distance as well as long as you don't move the laser head front to back it's in the same point but uh, as I said yeah I just use this little tab that I was provided with the laser machine and um, yeah as I said you can see there that it's, it's a nice little snug fit you sort of want it touching the surface of the material and the underside of that laser tube as well and that gives me my exact focal point so yeah, just a quick one there, just to show you how to set that. And um, yeah, thanks for watching.